A fatal fire here in South Mississauga. Flames broke out at this townhouse around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. We're learning that uh, the family had been living here since the 1980s and is well known in the neighborhood. And we have now confirmed that it was the elderly mother and her adult son sleeping up here on the second floor who did not survive. Firefighters made entry into the home. Uh, we had a crew that went into the basement to do a search. We had another crew that went onto the second floor to do a search. Our firefighters found one individual on the second floor in one bed bedroom, another individual in a different bedroom. Mississauga's fire chief confirming two people. Mississauga's fire chief confirming two people were without vital signs when they were pulled from the heavy flames and smoke that broke out at this townhouse in South Mississauga. City News has now confirmed with a family member that 76 year old Alice Kret, along with her son Danny, did not survive. Neighbors describe Alice as a very sweet lady who was a retired school custodian and say she was living here with her three grown children. She's been retired for the last 15 years, but she was a very hard worker, a super, super nice woman. Unfortunately, we all age and get older, and she was quite frail lately. And I know she wasn't in the best of health, so. I'm sure she had difficulty getting out if that's what happened. The adult daughter remains in hospital with life-threatening burns. Fire officials say she did manage to make it out of the house on her own, along with another brother who suffered just minor injuries. The cause of the fire is still unknown, but is no longer deemed suspicious after early reports from Mississauga's fire chief saying that there appear to be multiple points of origin. At first glance, uh, there it could be interpreted that there may be one, more than one area of origin of this fire. But once you look at it and you look at the fire spread, it's my opinion that there's one area of origin. We're still doing the investigation, but right now there's nothing to indicate that it's a suspicious fire. Now that investigator with the fire marshal's office believes that the fire began in the living room and spread to the basement with the thick smoke billowing up to the second floor. At this point, it's too soon to say what ignited the fire, but investigators will be here on scene for at least another day looking for those answers. In Mississauga, Shauna Hunt, City News.